But Patrick, first of all, we have to talk a little bit about global rally racing. What is this? So global, the, the name is Global Rally Cross, and it's a, so we race, it's a mixture of all different kind of motorsports. So we are racing on an asphalt track with dirt as well and jumps. So the cars are flying in the air and then you have to drive like a perfect race car driver on asphalt to find smooth lines and they have put everything together into what they call rallycross and it's very extreme uh, the races are very short uh, so it's a sport that is really growing in in america right now it's the second biggest motorsport uh, on tv so it starts to be really big and uh, it's so much fun to do well and i was told too that it's it's just particularly exciting because everything happens very quickly and lots of stuff is happening on that uh on the track that there's always something to be watching and that it moves so fast that because i was saying well my son who's 12 like this and they said oh this is the perfect racing to take somebody that age because there is no opportunity to get bored mm -hmm. that something's happening and it's exciting and takes your breath away yeah. on a regular basis yeah now you're going to be racing here in Los Angeles in just two weeks, correct? Yes, so the weekend after this, 12 and 13 of September, we have actually two races, so one on Saturday and one on Sunday down in Port of LA. So then they will, they build a track for us. So wherever we go, they build a track for that weekend. Uh, so we will be out there on a pair. So that will be a really cool, cool spot to race on. And they, uh, they will put together a, a perfect track for us with a big, big jump. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited for that race. And how big are the cars? Are these? They're actually small cars. Okay. So I'm driving a Ford Fiesta, uh -huh. uh, but it's an all wheel driven Ford Fiesta with 600 horsepower. And, and it's one of the fastest cars, race cars on the planet. So it's doing zero to 60 in 1.9 seconds. Wow. Uh, so it's faster than, for example, Formula One. They are doing it in 2.3 and it's faster than almost any car out on the streets. And doing all these curves and things though, is it, it, what are the highest speeds do you think you guys get to? I think maybe it all depends on the track, how they build the track, but maybe we've been up to 130, maybe wow. 140 this year. So it's, that is, it's, it's that's pretty That's definitely fast. a souped up Ford Fiesta. That yeah. is not my, my mother's Ford Fiesta. No, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, amazing. And of course, people are hearing you got a little bit of an accent that I am quite intrigued yeah. with. Uh, what is your country of origin? So I'm born and raised in Sweden, mm -hmm. northern Sweden, up in a ski resort. Uh, so I still spend my winters back in Sweden during the off season uh -huh. and I'm based out of Charlotte, North Carolina from May to November. Okay. Uh, so I'm, yeah, I'm getting the best of two worlds. Wonderful. Yeah. Well, we're, we're glad you're here with us today. And you came today with Karen Nelson from Puritas um, because you are part of Team Puritas yeah. Racing. I, I see it right there on, on your jersey. Yeah. And uh, why, why is water and uh, uh, autism in particular, because we already talked about the fact that autism is the, one of the main causes for, it is the cause for Puritas. Um, why is autism something that you're interested in particularly Patrick and so we met up uh, a year ago uh, we ended up on uh, on one of the galas at the same table and we started to talk about it and uh, for me it was a good thing to to represent and I had a vision in the future to be able to take autism families to the racetrack and and be able to show my world and be able to show what I'm doing and maybe do some VIP treatment around them and have them come and see the car and all of that. And we started to talk about it and had so many similar ideas what we could do for the future. And here we are a, 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 a one year later and we already have made a bottle with me on it. So that was the first step to start to uh, work together as a team. And uh, Karen had a, a million ideas what we can do for the future. So yes. I'm excited. Well, I'm excited about it too. I think, you know, what a great face um, to have speaking out um, and, and to represent, you know, because we talk all the time with autism that it's so important that we get individuals who uh, are, and 
the neurotypical world. I mean, I hate to put it that way, but we need people all the time to step up and be a part of the autism community that wouldn't otherwise have been a part of the community. Yeah. And I just want you to know how much I appreciate that as a parent of a child with autism. When somebody comes in and says, you know, I want to be a part of this and I want to be helpful and useful. We love it when family members, you know, when they say, oh, you know, I'm doing this because I have a child on the spectrum. But I don't know, there's something about it that's particularly meaningful when somebody doesn't have that and says, I yeah. I see this, I see your community, I see your kids, and I want to give back. That's really special to all of us. So we really appreciate that. And and Karen, how nice it is, is it to have this handsome young man um, representing your cause and your water? It's, it's brilliant for us. It's a great fit. Um, Patrick's lovely as a person. He's a world champion, which makes it very out in the public, a very good awareness. Um, as far as at events, we do have a lot planned for the future series. There's still things now where the families of autism will be able to come and meet him, get signatures. Unlike some of the other motorsports for GRC, you can come into the paddock. Mm -hmm. So we'll be announcing there'll be something soon on the website where they can actually join Team Periodist Racing Junior. Okay. So they'll get a monthly update where he'll be for different events. But we'll work out the timing where it's not the big noise and activity of race day. Right. Maybe it's the day before where he'll be available to meet and greet, but we're really going to pull as many families at their comfort level into his racing. And he's so open to his fans. He is by far the fan favorite, one of the fan favorites. He's our favorite, <laughs> but true gentleman. And he's all about health and just natural health. So he's a perfect fit for Prius. Wonderful.